all because both of you are no longer here. Aid me from the land of the spirits, for this battle is beyond me. I want to leave. I want to leave for the one I love. My uncle, Budo Wundi, is now a thorn in my flesh. I know I wasn't chosen by the Ani to serve, but I do believe that he has made a pact with them and now wants to use me as the prize. Mother, father, fight for me. Fight! Fight for me. Fight for me, mother. Ozioma is bent on following her own pathway. You have to fall back on initial promise, which as a matter of fact, the real one. Akunne, what are you talking about? You know what I'm talking about. You and I know the truth. Akone, what is truth? The truth is that it was informer our daughter you promised Ijele and the deity that we serve her. If they should bless us with children and wealth, now it has happened. Instead of you to fulfill your promise, you are not trying to drag uh, Ozoma into the, the arrangement. Nine. Give them informer to serve them. To save us from this danger I dreamt of. Akone. Day, you have not only proven that you cannot keep a secret, Akuna, you have also shown that you have the brain of a sheep, Ubula Tolo, that you are a complete non entity and a full elf. Elf, why would I give out my beautiful daughter, Ifoma, to Ijele to serve my Vene. I know you would say it. Let me say it before you. Even if she does not marry the prince, isn't it obvious that there are so many wealthy, wealthy, noble men? and their sons in this village and in the neighboring villages lining up, lining up Lakunde, seeking for the hand of my daughter in marriage. Why would I give her to Ijele when I have Ozioma, my slave? Yes! Who, if not for mercy, if not for mercy, I would have sacrificed to my personal god, Omenkite. And at best, sold to the slave traders at Abo in exchange for a jar of pan wine or a tuba of yam. When she defies my order and keeps torturing me with, with her constant cries to her dead parents. Nan, if you like, call me whatever name you wish. I don't care. Come to think of it. What have you not done to that girl? Yet, she survived them. What kind of torture have you not subjected her to? Yet, she's still living and serving her chief. Even when you poisoned her parents, sold out their lands, and took in Ozioma as a slave, yet she's still living and serving her chief. Can't you see the hand of her chief in her life? <laughs> Akunne! Akunne! No, man, Kitty, bend that mouth with which you use in saying all those useless things. If your mission 
is to bring me to ridicule before this community. May your man get it burn that mouth with which you use in saying all those useless things. Akunde, I regret the day I brought you into this house as a wife. If your mission is to expose my secrets and bring me to ridicule among members of this community, then may Omen Kitty feel that your bended mouth forever. He says! If you engage, all guys will work with Naji, is everything all right? When you see an elder running like this in broad daylight, uh, and you know all is not well. I was actually going to your house. My house? Uh, let, let us go to my house and sit down. Bam, 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 bam. It's not a matter of going to your house and sit down and discuss. Ijele is dying. Eh? Oh, yes. And she has vowed, in fact, she said she will place a curse on all of us if her successor is not presented to her for initiation immediately. Hey! Mm -hmm. But Obodo promised giving his daughter Uzioma to, to her. Hey. After all, she has been given to Ijele by, by Obodo and sealed. Uzioma does not want to have anything to do with Ijele or our deity. Hey. In fact, I, I hear she's planning to, in fact, she's planning, as they say, hey. 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 To, to, to marry that, that boy, Oti. Eh? That one that has been going against us in this community. Hey! And he said he's going to burn down our gods. Can, can, can you imagine that? May the gods of our party don't allow this to happen to us. Okay. She must keep to the covenant or we she's casted out. Ijele, all Ijele is demanding for is a daughter from Umude's family. Eh? Obudu has two daughters. Eh, let us persuade him to present one to her. Otherwise, eh, she will be forced to take any from the family. Let, that, let us just do that and then save this community of all these problems. Now, now, now as it is now, now we, we have to win it. Eh, Igwe's palace. Now, you roll along now. Inform Okoro and uh, Odo. Then I will tell uh, Igwe and the other elders. So let us meet at the palace. Hey! I'm on my way. I'm on my way. I'm on my way. Hey. I have become a lonely voice in our land. People are afraid and scared of speaking against evil. But I, Oti, I must speak. I must speak. Yes. I must say the truth. Evil men attack me day and night for me to shut up but me Oti hey but I cannot shut up I will continue to speak till the day I die our men are running away they are fleeing they are scared of coming back because of evil too but I will continue to speak until all the evil people, men, in this, in, in this land are dead. Yes, evil people. Evil. Evil men. You people should speak against evil. Speak against evil. Evil. They are everywhere. Why do we have a lot of mentally deranged madmen and women in this our community, Abaji? Eh? Since I came back, everywhere I go into, anywhere I walk into, I don't see them around everywhere. What is happening? Oh, look at that handsome young man. That man there, he's not mad though. Mm -hmm. Even as I'm speaking with you now, I don't know the rot I will incur after telling you this. Mm -hmm. They say those who oppose the evil men in this village are then to be made mad. Oti here challenged them and they turned his brain. 
Yet, he had the love for one beautiful young girl in this village, Ozioma. And vow never to stop speaking against those evil men. They are very strong and they control a lot of influence and power in this village. I see. In that case, I will not return to this community. Hey, I don't want to be fooled for evil men. I won't. It's only those who oppose them that they keep to their rights. If you don't oppose them, you are safe. So, in that case, the only lone voice speaking against them is that of that young man. I'm telling you, and then they tend to be destroying you. And him on his own side, vow never to stop speaking until he drops dead. Told you that? Yes, Igwe. Then fetch me or bodo speedily. An action must be taken to that effect immediately. I, I, I will, Igwe. I will go and fetch him right away. And the others, they are on their way here. Okay. Hurry up. Please. I don't know. I don't know. Yes, Igwe. Go and get the other guards and tell them to be alert. Yes, Igwe. Right? Yes, Igwe. Go. Yes, Igwe. Since your hell bent on bringing a curse to this family, then you must go to the Igwe and exonerate me. And then tell the Igwe your plans and how you plan to plunge this entire community into annihilation. Ozioma, you must do that. You must do it. Uncle. You have always treated me like a slave. I feed on carcass. Yet you eat good food and throw it away. I have gone through unimaginable torture and ridicule in your hands. If my sorrows bring you so much joy, uncle, haven't you had enough joy over the years? Must you drink my blood like palm wine to be satisfied? Ozioma, your sorrow ends the minute you leave this house and move over to Ngena Nevo to replace Ijele and begin to serve our deity. Ozioma, failure to do that means destruction for this community and more for this family because you are a promise made which failure to fulfill means nothing but destruction don't you understand <sighs> ozioma you are a community property move over to the igwe's palace <laughs> My friend, get up and get out. Get out. Akunde, you have seen yourself. Have you seen yourself? Akunde, see what you have done to yourself. See what you have done to yourself. Ozioma, look at what Akunde has done to herself. See, if Omen Kitty can do this, Ozioma, Ozioma, please, please. Think of what one Vene will do. Because you're not to your jelly, your mother. Hmm? 
beg her for forgiveness and embrace the life which you have been called upon to do. Come on, get out of this place. Get out, get out of here. I'm off your zoo. Uncle, what manner of threat or charms have you not used on me? You have killed every single man who has come to ask my hand in marriage. You have made some mad, including Oti. You have made me run mad for four months. And I have bled for seven months. The only reason I'm still alive is because the giver of life says it's not yet my turn. I will not be scared. I will not go and serve one Bene because I know that the gods have not chosen me to. You better kill me, uncle. You better kill me. Because I will not go and serve the gods when I have not been called to serve. Kill me. Kill me so I can rest eternally, uncle. Kill me. So, Ozioma, you have altered abomination with your mouth. Ozi Oma, each girl no go nuan say. Hey! Ozi Oma, for daring to speak so boldly to me. Hey! Ozi Oma, wait for me. Wait for me. Wait and see what Omen Kitty will do. Ozi Oma! Hey! There is fire on the mountain. Yeah, there is fire on the mountain. What is it? Uh, Nadi I, Ijele. Ijele is sick. And she demands to see uh, and initiate her sex the, the other elders are in the palace mm -hmm. waiting to take a decision. Mm -hmm. What? What decision? Nadi What decision is to be taken? Ozioma here is the one dedicated to the nine level. I have repeatedly told you people the challenges I am having in making her accept her destiny. I have also told you. I have told everybody. But she will not take it. She will not take it. Hey, the best thing we will do is to bundle her up and take her to the shrine. Take out of the shrine and make out of oh, your duty! Oh, she has been called upon to do! is better discussed sitting down. And besides, the priestess of one Vene must be treated with all the pampering and love in the whole world and not tied down like a goat or, or, or tortured. This, this is torture. Anyway, I'll be waiting for you at the palace. <laughs> Wait for me, let me go and get to me. For men getting For market days. I cannot do anything now to help her. The evil men she spoke against are far away from my vision. Come back in four days. I am not strong. As you wish, 
to suffer than progressing. Why? Any God that is retrogressive rather than progressive is evil and should be destroyed. No sense. Are you, you then you can, can destroy, destroy you The gods of Abaji land will continue to destroy the evil ones and I, Oti, will continue to call on them till they act. Yes. Ah, God! Since you are not comfortable in your state of madness, let me add you to this. Maybe an excruciating pain can beg you to be fired. Oh, yeah, la babe! You see, woo woo! You're not my chief! You can do your worst! You can go on and do your worst! Yes, you can do your worst! I will continue to speak against the evil till you are destroyed, till the last day of my bread. A good God of our people gives life, hope, and prospers his people. All you do is to destroy your people and, 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 and protect the evil ones in this land. What kind of data are you? What kind of data am I asking you? Go on and do your worst. Do your worst. Oyala, do your worst. You're not a good god. You need to be destroyed. No. Don't want any for that. Igwe Gadio. Igwe, sincerely speaking, I don't understand it anymore. I mean, how can what a character like Naji said be said to be true, Igwe? Ozioma was personally dedicated by my very self to the deity to take over from Ijele on behalf of the larger Umude family, Igwe. How then can the same Ijele turn around and say, any of my daughter, any of my daughter can be used to replace Ozioma? How? When all of you know that I visit Ijele regularly, she did not say it to me. Eh? 
Then she looked for all and every other, any other person in this community to tell that kind of message. It is Naji. Igwe. There is a foul place somewhere. This thing has been doctored. This thing was doctored. There is a foul play. Naji. Are you denying it? Yeah. Obodo. Are you accusing me of lying? Igwe, Ijele is still alive. Let us go and ask her. She will still say the same thing, Igwe. Because Naji, you have set her up against me. Will you deny it? If you have nothing to hide, and you truly have the interest of our budget at heart, as you made all of us believe, why don't you replace your rebellious daughter with a humble one and let Ijele depart in peace? After all, you were the one who made the pledge, not us. And Ijele had made an alternative choice for you. So what are you talking about here? Uh, <clears throat> Naji, sit down. Please, sit down. It is alright, sit down. <clears throat> uh, Igwe. Mm. Naji, you have made your point and it is quite clear. The promise is a promise and it must be kept as a promise, especially to the gods. But in all this, what I have to add is this. If indeed we want to be fair to Ubudu, then I am suggesting that he should gather all his daughters, including the rebellious one, Ozioma. As long as Ijele is still breathing, let him take all his daughters to her for her to make a choice. Whichever choice she makes supersedes the previous arrangement. Because we are talking about the present and not the past. Well said, Achara. Obodo, gather all your daughters by sunrise. And go with some of her elders to see Ijele. Let Ijele pick her successor. Whatsoever she decides is final. Yeah. If she insists on the girl said to be rebellious and she refuses, she will face banishment and the ultimate wrath of our God, Mwampe. Aye! The Igwe has spoken. Yeah. Uh, Igwe, I will do as you have said. I will do everything you have said if only to prove to these conspirators that I have the interest of Abaji community at heart anytime, any day. I will do what you have said, Igwe. Igwe, I, I will suggest that uh, Naji and I pay a visit to Ijele to see how she's faring and also to promise her that we will come with her, with her successor. I agree with you. Ijele must have her love and care until her last breath. Even the incoming Ezimwai must have greater love. It is indeed a great privilege to be chosen by the gods to serve them. Please, pass that across to your daughters. I will, Igwe. I will. I will tell Ijele I will send some fruits and um, smoked fish to her through the guards later. Cannot fight for people that stand for the truth. Like Akunne and Oti. Then what kind of a God is it? How can Abaji suddenly be controlled by a strange God with immense powers brought in by my uncle and his likes? One day, 
just one day, light will overshadow darkness. Just one day. What are you always trying to say to me? succeed then you are dead wrong because I have just left Ijele's place and tomorrow she will choose you despite the fact that I presented my own daughters and she rejected them Uzioma if you want to know your real place in this community Try disobeying the Igwe or the gods, and then you will see what will happen to you. Look, Ozioma, I have just come to warn you. I have just come to warn you, like the good father that I am to you, not to even try or dare to say a word. Huh? Then, once you are chosen, do you hear me? My destiny lies with my chi, and not you, Uncle. If I have been chosen to serve, then serve I will. 
But if all this is because of your evil machinations, so that you and your likes can pocket the people of this land and manipulate them at your will, then you have failed. For at this point, I have chosen to leave my life and destiny in the hands of Chukukiki. Tomorrow is just hours away. And let me tell you, don't even think of running away. Who's your man? Because you are under heavy surveillance in this community. Look at you. Just, just look at you. Who's the dead body that does not know who owns it. You are here eating a bacham hmm? Instead of the delicious food, the delicious drink that is always presented to Ijele, which the people will automatically start giving you if you move over to Ngena and Nebo. Who's your man? Do you know that Ijele has used the money she has realized from the shrine through the sale of cow, goat, chicken, and all assorted things that the people bring to her to build 14 huts? Who's your mother 14 hot for her people? And you are here. You, you, you are here rejecting the best opportunity that I have ever Presented to you. Hi! Uncle. Hmm. You have just laid bare your evil heart desires. So you want to use me as a bait? As a tool to obtain food, money and animals from the people of this land? Obtain them and bring them to you? While your own daughters marry and live happily with the ones that they love? Even the gods one then has heard of your evil desire. It's okay. It's all right. Ademma. You see, I am saying all this. Hmm? Because today may be the last day that I will address you as Ozioma. Hey! As from tomorrow, it will be um as a one in this. Depending on the name you choose. Eh? <laughs> you know, I will even be bowing for you. <laughs> Your father will be bowing for you. Hey! You're a lucky person. But if you try it otherwise, if you try it otherwise, Ozioma. Do you know why father said we'll be going to Ngena and Nivo tomorrow? I don't know, but I think it's because of mother's illness. I am having a strange feeling. Mother has been trying to tell us something, but she couldn't because of her affliction. I feel she doesn't want us to go. Okay. Mm. By tomorrow we shall know. Mm. But considering how much father loves us, I don't think he will lead us into something that would harm us. All right. Tomorrow will determine. Oh, I'm tired. I feel like sleeping. <laughs> so you want to lay it down? I am. Oh. What am I going to do? What am I going to do if Ijele fails on her promise and did not choose Ozioma before the elders? I cannot stand to see any of my daughters 
Ogechi or Ifoma become the servant of Ngene and Evo. I want to use Ozioma to satisfy my pledge to the gods and also use her to influence opinion in this community until I become the Igwe. Her being there will also guarantee that I will be enjoying all the delicious food and drinks and sell off all the goods and rams as I want. Oh, why is Ozioma bent on spoiling the beautiful life I had planned out for myself? Why, I ask again, why? Why? I have done everything humanly possible, including torture, to sway her, yet she remains ever defiant. I pray. I pray Ijele keeps to her word. I pray. Thank your chi that we're late. If I'm a widow's first daughter, broke my head and almost killed Naji and her father. When she discovered that her mission to Ijele was for, for a choice to be made between herself and, 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 and her sister. Hey, Wanyo, how did you deliver to this? Did the father use force on them? Like he did to the one said to be rebellious? That one is a saint compared to Bodo's three daughters. Eh? Eh? Naji has gone to inform uh, Ijele. And I'm on my way to intimate the Igwe about the situation. Eh? Serious trouble, though. You are serious trouble. Eh? What are you people still standing here waiting? Come on, let us go. Let us go to the palace. Father, we are going nowhere with you. We must all go there. We must. Because I have assured the Igwe that we are all coming. Yes. Look, let me tell you. Ijele will not choose any of you. Ah! Uh -huh. Ijele will choose Ozioma. Let us go. Let's go to the palace. Father, better go and sort yourself out with Ijele. For I am not stepping out of this compound. Yes, I will not. Not in my kingdom. God! You will run to the house of Iko. Tell him I want him here now. Yes, he with will. all healthy men in our budget. Yes, he will. Must be taken now. Yes, he will. Please. Take us. I may be sick. But with the last gaps of breath. I shall still deal with whosoever I want to in Abachi land. Naj! Uh, 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 I have the last energy reserved for any battle. Obodo made a promise to one Bene, and he got his blessings. And that promise he must fulfill now. Naj!
Who do I hear that is disobeying the orders of the king and the priestess? But Ijeli, being a half spirit and a half human, she recalled the last energy she reserved and she took care of things herself. So do cause for love. Yes, she has in her possession now her successor as the next priestess of Abaji. The former, the daughter of uh, Bogodowunde. Yes, yes, yes. yes. Uh, we are on our way to her place. Mm -hmm. uh, so we are on our way to uh, uh, Ingina Anevo. Beautiful. 
Otiko, Ikoro, go and tell the angry youth at the village square to disperse. Tell them Ijele has taken care of the situation. Yes. Now go. Ikoro Kenengi. I have always known that you are a witch. But I did not know that you were this powerful. Today, I have confirmed it. Shut up! If you think you have won the war, Oziyama, Oziyama, if you think you have won the war, then break up! Because if Omen Kitty, my personal God fails, this God will not! Oziyama, this God, this God will not fail! This God will not fail! I heard your voice from afar off as I was coming to your house. You know I've always supported you. But I don't want anything that will give credit to those that are against us in this community. Especially Uzoma. Your shouting to the hearing of everyone will make it obvious that she's innocent. And even the God that we brought from that foreign land will not be able to harm her. Abai, Abai, what do I do? Abai, what? Hi, hi, Abai, what do I do? What do I do? Abai, I have done everything, everything possible. I have maltreated this girl in every kind of way. Unfortunately. The more I maltreat her, the more I, I, I seem to be paying for my sins, for all my evil. Abai, I did everything, everything possible to give her out to Ijele. But it ended up fruitless. The evil seed, that reminds me, the evil seed you helped me to plant into her does not appear to be germinating. She moves about freely as if insulated from everything happening to her while I live in agony. Abai, I am living in agony. You don't understand. My daughter Ifoma has been taken by jail. My wife is lying there, an imbecile. Why this thing? Hey. Why this thing moves about freely in my house? Abai, let me ask you. Is it that the charms we brought are not powerful? Is it that they are not powerful? Or that her, her chi, her personal God, is more powerful than the wicked God we brought to manipulate our people? And by what is happening? What is happening? I heard the news. That is why I came so we can plan. <laughs> huh? I think this is what we do. We greet you. Greetings too. You are welcome. Thank you.
she shall start her incubation from today. And she will not eat or drink. It will aid her spirit as it departs partially from the world to the land of the spirit. And when she returns, she must be able by then to understand the language of the spirit so as to be communicating with them. So you inform the king and the people of Abaji to congregate here in seven days with four cows, four goats, and eight cocks, plant foods and drinks to offer to the gods while the next goddess is outdoors. Isn't it your Rama? We are most grateful to you. <laughs> and we are also very happy that you suddenly regained your health and energy. Which means you are going to be with us for a longer period oh, yes. and we are going to cherish it. Oh, yes. <laughs> the girls in their magnanimity have decided to add more days to complete my mission. But how long I'm going to live is what I cannot tell now. But while you prepare for the celebration of the new priestess, you also prepare for my eventual demise. Isn't it? Is it why? I'm sure you are going to stay with us for a longer period. Go. Just go now. I said go! Eating to get energy, then speak. See what they've done to me. Even in all this, they can never take away my voice. Eat. I'll come back for the calabash. My woman of the sun. Oti, my love. Don't you want to call me the woman of the sun? The story about the woman of the sun didn't end well. I do not like you liking me to her. No. You are the woman of the sun. The one they told us of could not bear the son of the sun and died in misery. But before you, I see light. And in your hands, I see the son of the sun. But you're the only one who come forth and share in my struggle. I don't know why you're so much in a hurry to leave while I speak. Ozioma, I know you love me so much. Please, stay and speak with me against the evil till the day of liberation. Please. I have to go now, Oti. Please eat something. I'll come back for the calabash. <laughs> Abaji, the only woman that has the courage. Do not fear them. Do not fear them. Their powers cannot demean the will of the oppressed. Very soon, very.
very, very soon. You won't walk very soon. Very, very soon. People like you will not be walking the roads of a virgin fear. Very soon. Very soon. How did I end up doing this to myself? Even though I worship one vene, the wicked god, that I have brought from a gala, and other gods like Omenkiti. But, losing my first daughter, a girl, rich man, are queuing for her hand in marriage. Losing her to Ijele and the deity, it, it's really heartbreaking. How and where do I start tackling all this? How? How? Agbai. Mm. <laughs> yes, Agbai. I will follow exactly what Agbai told me. Hmm. Yes. Yes. Hmm. Yes. Well, that is the how to start it. I will begin to do all that he advised me. That's right. Hmm. Agbai. I know you are the one that grinds in the day. What brings you to my house by night? Ajo Debia, misfortune. The more misfortune the God from the Gala inflicts on our people, the richer will become. <laughs> that I know. But what is it that could not wait for the day to replace the dark night? Ajo Debia. Three more people have been inflicted with madness. Amara, the daughter of Adobe, is now deaf and dumb. Oti has been inflicted with a very big EB. And the wife of Obodo is now disfigured in the mouth. <laughs> Abai, take away everything about Oti because his spirit is not of this land he is meat for the gods as for the others we will try and cure them or better still be made kingdom <laughs> that is why I came so that you can start the mission first thing tomorrow morning whatever remedy you prefer is what they will do. But you and I know that they'll never get cured. <laughs> but as long as we continue to make them and get richer, mm. uh -huh, there's no problem. And as long as the God from Igala that is upon you continues to be with you, we will get richer and richer and richer. Aboy, you are right. You know I have a way of turning the eyes of Juan Vene, the good god of Abaji, from my own business. The people of Abaji will continue wallowing in their misery. And we that knows what goes on will continue to benefit. Oh, exactly, exactly. You know, as your information master, mm. I will continue to feed you with correct and current information about the happenings in the community. But I want to beg for a favor. Please, keep it secret. Let my people and my friends not know that we have any dealings 
So please protect me as you have always done. You and I determine what goes up in Abaji. Keep bringing the information. I, Ajodi Bebinofia, will continue to act on it. I will give you your share. Eh? <laughs> Do not worry. Do not be afraid. For no one shall know that we have any dealings. Mm. So long as the people continue wallowing in this misery. But I know the house of Omodo. I know the house of Adobe. But the other three mad people, I don't know their house. Hmm. He came in. The brother of Obasi is one. Anayo, the son of Obele, the one that came from the district and insulted our God, is the second one. As for the third one, I don't really know his name. But they say he's one of the Christians that came from the neighboring community and preached against our good people, whom he called evil men. As I speak with you, as I speak with you, he has been tied to a tree by the river. <laughs> Very well then, Abai. Very well then. Abai, tomorrow I will proceed to Bodo's house because he's the biggest meat. But I will want you to give me every detail which he has given to you. Then I will use it to work against him. I will give you the date and the time it happened. Even the biggest one the evil seed that he planted on his late brother's daughter, Ozioma. You know, I am his closest confidant. I have all the information at the back of my hand. <laughs> Abai, put them here. Yeah. Give me the details. Uh, you can rest assured. I will give you every information. <laughs> <laughs> Abai! Ajadibia! <laughs> Binofia! Yeah. <laughs> My woman of the sun. Always on time. The message is ready. I had a vision that by noon tomorrow there shall be a massive attack on all the evil men in Abaji and my people shall be liberated. I came from Calabash. Did you understand the message my mother of saw? Yes, Uti, my love. Now the Calabash. Please. My woman of the sun, that is the speed. My woman of the sun, that is the speed. By, by noon tomorrow, the story of Abadi's liberation shall be all over the land. I love you, my woman of the sun. I love you. I love you. Oh. Oh.
One I refused to die. They have failed in shutting the only mouth that speaks against them. I am glad you believed me, woman of the sun. You've come again, my love. I can see you carrying the sun of the sun. How so? I have never known any man. The only man I know is you. And you and I cannot be together as man and woman until after our marriage. How then do you see me carrying a son? Even as my eyes glue to the sun, I can see him. Oti, I love you. And I won't leave you. I'll stand by you throughout this ordeal until the evil men in Abaji are defeated. I believe you. I believe you. Your love gives me strength to fight on. And forever we shall be. Let's go and find a cure to this affliction of yours. When they are defeated, it shall go. Just be patient, my woman of the sun. When you hear the first cock crow in Abadi, I said the first cock crow. Not the second, not the third. Remember, the first one that crows, rub it quickly on our lips three times. And you will do it for 17 days. At the end of 17 days, if you do not make a mistake, she will begin to hear and talk. Um, Ajodibe, um, you know how Baji is very big. How can I know the first cock? That will crawl. And how fast can I rub it before another crawls? Eh? Knowing that five or ten cocks can crawl at the same time. I have told you what the gods said. They sent me to you. Did you go to them? Did you? I did not. But Ajadibia, there is something I did not tell you earlier. I did not tell you that I went to Ijelewani, the mother of all mothers. Eh? And she said I should come back in four days' time. And tomorrow is going to make it the fourth day. You do not need to go to Ijele. She sent me. Or oh, did I not tell you exactly what is your problem? Didn't I? You did. And I'm very grateful. Okay. When there is a will, the ways sprout forth. Do exactly like I've told you. And I will keep begging the God. Ajodibia, may one vene keep blessing you. Ada, take the yam. Woman, where are you running? Why did you see me and run? Evil man, the good God of Albaj land will defeat all of you, and this land shall be free. It will happen very soon. 
very, very soon. Oti, you are not afraid at all. Afraid? Afraid of what? What haven't they done to me? My chi will be angry with me if I stop speaking. The very reason they've not captured the souls of Abaji people is because they have someone like me that attacks them every day. Evil. Let's go. My woman of the sun. I, 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 I'm sorry. Let's go. I could not wait until tomorrow to bring the money. In fact, I had to go to uh, one vene, to the shrine, to borrow some money because of the urgency of what I want you to do for me. <laughs> See, when the Igwe called me this evening, he was shaking. He was shaking. I said, he was, he was shaking. He, I knew it was the effect of what you told him. I knew. I just did it again. He just was shaking. He went. He, he was shaking. You see, I just did it again. You are a wonderful man. You are a great man. <laughs> if the evil seed germinates and the Igwe takes the action that I want him to take, ah, Bike, if it happens, ah, hell, then I am a free man. I will become a free man in this community, Ajodibike. Because the truth is that I have committed a lot of evil. Obodo. Obodo Mude. I was cooking the proto for your man before you came. Aside you. I want to prove a point that I am and will ever remain Ajodibike because they casted doubt on what I said. And to prove my potency, I want them to see the evil seed germinate. The wicked Egala God kill faster than the heal. And our duty is to see it happen. I will apply the herbs as you instructed on my wife. Mm -hmm. But let me start going. The night is thick. <laughs> uh, continue applying the herb. She will soon get well. And may the gods be with you. Hey! I hope I am not a fool. Hmm. The wicked Egala God, which you and your friends brought, kill faster than it heals. Your wife, your wife will die in a misery. And your brother's daughter, Uzioma, 
will also die in our misery. Her blood shall be on your head. Fool. We are needed at Digwe's palace. I saw it with my eyes. I'm still confused. So what? Ozioma. Ozioma has conceived the evil that Jojiba talked about. In one night, boom, her stomach grew big. Big like that of a woman's pregnancy of nine months. Eh? As I'm talking with you now, the youths are leading her to Digwe's palace. We are needed at Digwe's palace now. Let us go. Hey! Mwambene! So, I thought it was right after all. Hey! Let me talk my 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 they have gotten my woman of the sun. They have crippled the strength that supports the voice. I will be here watching and waiting. Our chin never sleeps and will fight for us. My woman of the sun! Where are you? I'll be here, watching and waiting. I can hear your voice. I can hear your voice calling me from afar. I can hear it. Having confirmed what the AZD has said about you and your evil plot, I want to state categorically that your evil plot to deliver this child you conceived overnight in order to enthrone an evil kingdom over Abaji has failed. Yes, yes, yes. yes.
by the authority bestowed on me as, as the Igwe of Abaj, I hereby forever banish you to the evil forest where you will live and die. You see? Nobody will have anything to do with it. And when you die, the vultures will feed on your flesh. As you plan to do to our people and our God. You see? You see? Youth! My king! Take her out to the evil forest! Igwe! Igwe! Take her out! Anna! Please! Get up! Stand up! Anna! 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 Are you rebels or traitors of Abaji? Get out of my way, madman! Yes! Or both of you will be taken to the evil forest! Yes! Lordy! Lordy rebels! I can see! I can see! Wait for me! Boys! Wait for me! Boys! Wait for me! You will take him to the evil forest or leave him here where he has always been! No, let's take him to the evil forest! Grab him now! Grab him now! I must warn you. One Vene is a jealous God that fights all those who opposes her. If you have any other way, any other way of doing it, do it. Do you hear me? But I must warn you. Do not use foul language. Or force on Ijele or one then. We have had you. I've always loved Ifoma and want to make her my wife. When Ogechi came to tell us how she was taken against her will, we decided to see how we can help. My father. Igwe of Alamiri, who has so many female servants, has decided to give as many female servants to one Vene for the release of Ifoma. So we have no problems at all. I, I cannot make such a presentation by myself. Hmm? I cannot. <laughs> uh, you will make it alone and on your own. It is better that way. <clears throat> I see. Ijeli have no option than to accept the irresistible offer. Ah! That's correct. Shh. Lower your voice. You should not be talking loud. Eh? 
the walls have ears. Even these trees have ears. Let me show you the way to the place. Hmm? Because you see, under no circumstances must I be seen with you in that place. Very well then. If you say so, lead the way. allow any of my men to fall into the arms of those rebels. Inside this hut are various weapons to protect my son woman. Thank you. One day, just one day, One day, the regime of all this evil shall come to pass. Just one day. My stomach is heavy. They struck you with proto dead belly and gave me a proto dead scrotum. But I tell you something. They can strike our bodies, but can never touch our souls. That is the offer, Ijele wine. Accept it and become the richest Ijele wine ever lived. And release the woman I intend to spend the rest of my life with. That's nice of you. You're welcome. I reject it. I reject the offer. You what? Yes. <clears throat> the girls are pleased with her. She's almost ready to be like me. So leave here. We are not living here. If you do not want peace, we shall give you war. I am the strong medicine man for the prince of Isimiri. As you can see, we are always ready for war. Peace on the left and war on the right hand. Are you a bird? After overfeeding itself, decided to challenge his cheek to a wrestling bout. Take it easy, Ibe. We're not here for confrontation. Let's try peace first. Ije Lewai, I beg of you, please, release the woman I want to spend the rest of my life with. I beg you with whatever you held secret. Set her free in peace, or we shall throw a challenge. <laughs> ah, I do not blame you. I blame Obodo Wood. Who cowardly thought he could eat his egg and still have it? Go and inform him that the gods are watching all his antics and will soon come for him. <laughs> Sometimes. Words like this makes me run out of patience. Set her free now, or I will show you what I'm capable of. I see. You are an overzealous young man, and I pity you. I do not have any business with you. The man that made a covenant should come for his daughter if he 
indeed wants her. Not you. And let me warn you. I am not afraid of you or whatever they call you. Now set her free before I show you what I'm capable of. When the gods want to kill a dog, they make it deaf and dumb. I won't do enough. Now I will teach you a little. Ibe. 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 circumstances she go near Oti and Duzioma while she is still in his possession. And now that he's armed and mad, he can kill anybody like he tried to kill Iko. And the girls will deal with both of them whenever he wishes. We have done that which I expected to do. Uh, I know that with time, he will drive her away or even kill her himself. Uh, well, no problem. I, I will pass on your message, Igwe. Please let me go home. Eh? Uh, we have more important things to think about. We shouldn't bother about them. We, we are going of our new princess. Uh, let us think about that one. As we are uh, gathering here, uh, just uh, remind you that it should take by force any animal in any household uh, that is still resisting the thing they let I will pass your instructions with you. Uh, let me go now. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You have not said a word. Since you returned here with your medicine man backing like a dog. Hey, Kuke, shut up. I don't understand. What is our next option? Huh? Because, Your Highness, it is my wish that my daughter Ifoma becomes your wife. So that I can become an in-law to the royal family. Yeah, Mokem, talk to me. You are confusing me the more with your silence. I don't understand. Say something now. Talk to me, let's know what to do. You know what, Smazi Obodo? By tomorrow morning, I shall execute the second option I have in mind. Excuse me, I will be back.
I have not seen my in-laws. I I hope he did not go confronting Ijele. Father, what are you talking about? Which in-laws? What do you mean, what in-laws? How many in-laws do I have? I am talking about the prince of Isimili. I'm not here. The one they say his father locked him up and warned him never to step into this land again. Come to think of it, did you ever think his father would allow him come back to this land after seeing what his medicine man was reduced to? If the man that was supposed to be protecting him was dealt with by Ijele, what do you think that would happen to him if he tries any other thing? with her and she paid the price. Your story! 
must be greater than the former woman of the sun. You must not die in misery. I, Otuman Joku, will fight this war with you. Sing! I can hear your voice from afar. I can hear your voice. Sing for me, my song woman. Sing for me. I can hear your voice from afar. I can hear it. I am not running away. I am only going on a sabbatical. I am so tired. Everybody has run away. Leaving me and this imbecile of a wife with her endless nightmares. I am going to my mother's place. If I can get four days of good sleep, land of my ancestors, I will come back. I will come back and continue from where I stopped. Menaji, I'm only going to my mother's place. Bale Zibnam. You want to run away? Conniving effortlessly to take her away from me. Is it why? Am I crazy? How would I, I, how would I connive with, with anybody? I only made a promise which I fulfilled. And you keep lying, even in front of a spiritual being like me. No, no, no. Is it why? I, I cannot lie. Hey, I cannot lie. You see, sometimes I, I was confused. I was confused. I did not have a hand. Or, or in the plan, or, or the, on the plot, or anything of that nature. I did not. I did not. You are a man of two faces. The most dangerous human being in Abachi land. Baby, why? I am not bad. I am not a bad man. Mm. Baby, why? Because if I am a bad man, mm. why would I give my daughter to you? Obodongude, you did not give her to me. I took her, not you. Hey, make your man. I know. Odogun why? Hello. Na idem ma. Okacha se ma. Hey, I did not have a hand in me to. Eh? In fact, I was the one that lured her back. You don't know. She wanted to elope with the prince, but I stopped it. I was the one that stopped it. See, it was the prince and his people, the prince of Okemi. They were the ones that came looking for her, not me. But you housed and planned her adoption. I saw everything in the spirit. Oh, yes. Hey, Naidema, Ezibon, why? I was confused. You know, there, there were too many trouble. I was so confused. See, some of the things I may have said may be a slip of tongue. Others I may have did or made suggestion to that is against the will of the gods is a product of mental confusion. You will not understand. Okay, look at it. It's in one. Tomorrow is the outdooring of the new priestess. Why will I not be there? Why? Why? Even this journey that I am about to take, I don't understand anymore. I am just confused. Everything around me is all confusion. I can't, I, I don't know. But what will I say? I am sorry. Norma, I am sorry. 
My intention was to strike you with madness. But having said sorry, I will forgive you. To let you know that I and the gods are watching all of your evil deeds and plots. Nama, no, don't, don't do this. Nama, wait! Wait! Hey. Jodibia could not cure. The wicked God we brought kept cursing without even a single blessing. Ajodibia can inflict any kind of terrible ailment on anybody but cannot cure even a simple headache. Ogbodo is crippled and lives with an incapacitated wife courtesy of his evil deeds. Even his biological daughter, who is now the new priestess, cannot cure them. Who knows what will become of me if I do not change? Today, I'm making the decision. I will return all this evil money to the people we lied to in the name of Helen. That is my final decision. Enemy number one, Oihebo. No, Oti, take it easy. Enemy. I am joining your army now. It's been two years since Ijele died and the reign of a new one. And since then, all I've been experiencing in Abaji is terror and misery. We now have more mad people than sane ones. We now have more sick people than people that are healthy. <coughs> we now have more hungry people than people that feed well in Abaji. But in all this, you are the only one who has not given up in the fight to liberate Abaji. Today, I am joining your army. Either I live Heard that the former is so angry that she was forced to serve Malvene. So she swore to inflict pains and misery and wipe off Abaji. The former has joined ranks with people like you. To deal with people of Abaji. Is that not so? I'm no longer with them. I am now fully with you. I'm ready to go with you all the way in the struggle. <laughs> Oti, I am with you. Enemy! No, no. Enemy! No, I'm not with you. I shall recruit you into my army. We shall continue to speak against evil. All of them are wiped out from Abaji. Hmm? I'm with you all the way. Yes.
our man. Ah, we use the seeds of the wicked to demonstrate why I am Chuku Abiyama. Be it unto me, according to your words, my creator. Wants from me now. More misery on the people. <laughs> so we can continue feeding out of their misery. Remember, I have been keeping you warm on cool nights since you came to power. And I have also kept all my covenant with you by making sure I bring gift items and assorted food. Is it why? The more the people suffer, the richer I become. <laughs> <laughs> So, you want me to inflict madness on the rich ones? So you can get richer at your DBLB Nothia? If you're malamized and why? That is the only way to keep you glowing. Their misery becomes our joy. They bring to us. We bring to you. We also make sure we buy beautiful things for you. Is it one? Consider it done. Those who forced me here will never know peace. Including my own father. <laughs> He's done it! He's a man! <laughs> He's done it! <laughs> but, wait, are you telling me that the woman I just saw is the same old drama that I know? How about it? My woman of the sun will be the second in command. And you shall be the third. Agreed? I have not gotten over the shock of seeing Ozoma after two years. I thought she was long dead in the evil forest. So you come in with her? Come, why did you bring me here to behold such a thing? She is a big promise waiting to be fulfilled. No, she's cast. How can a human being be pregnant for two good years and still living? I wanted to join you, but with what I saw today, mm -mm, I am more confused than I was before. In short, I am going crazy. Ah, boy, this is not the act of a true warrior. Join me, let us defeat them in a day, in a full combat. Mm. Come, let us finish the briefing. Let me finish with the briefing.
ocho o blog wala kwa I brought it for you to do Open your mouth. No! Um. Open your mouth! Mm. Mm. Where are you? Mm. I don't know what you're saying though. All I know is that the gods of Allah knows I'm trying. Whenever you people feel like eating, you eat. Or if you want to die, you die. This is your food. Okote, what is it? The queen is running mad inside the house. Mad? Yes, Igwe. Go and grab her. Tie her up before she starts destroying things. Yes, Igwe. Quickly! Ha! Otiko, what is it? Igwe. Who's your mother, witch? Is still alive. Alive? She has grown into a monster. She's pregnant after two years. Yes! She walked into the community from the evil forest. As we speak, she lives among us. And everybody that set their eyes on her collapsed. Igwe, Alu Emego. Hi. She is the one that has made my wife mad. She has come to enthrone evil. As foretold by Ajo Dibia Binofia. <clears throat> now, go and tell Ikoro to mobilize all the youths and do whatever they can this time to kill her. I have given the permission. Let them kill her, burn her alive, and stop evil from taking over our land. Igwe, go! Igwe, go! There is no time for pressing it. Go! But if I want to win, I can't win. 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 I my woman of the sun, are you okay? Okay, I'm here for you, okay? What? Where is she? I'm going to see for my face. 
Who are you talking about? Oziyama, the evil one. Me and you. You. Iko, you rebel. What do you want again? She is carrying the seed of evil that will destroy this community and enthrone the reign of witches. So she deserves to die for the child. Yes. yes. See, you luckily escaped the last time I shot at you. This time around, I am going to use a bigger weapon for you and your rebels. I said, you laugh. Yeah. Bring her. You, you will soon see her. Wait for me. Let me call her. Call her. Yes, she's coming. Hold on. Call her out. My woman of the sun. My woman of the sun, are you okay? That your will be done in my life. And fast. This pain is too much for me. It's too much. What did you see? I think she's in the hut. 
I saw them walking a moment ago. Are you sure? Very, very sure, Ikoro. And I think she's in pain. He managed to take her inside. And he's just attending to her at this moment. Very much in pain. That means she's in labor. She's about to give birth to the evil. We must strike at once. Now listen. I want, once we get there, immediately we get there, I want you to set fire on the heart while you and you mark the door. Yes, Ikoro. Do you understand? Yes, Ikoro. Okay, Freddy. I am, I still remain, His Royal Highness, Igwe Ikeoha, Naji Ngodo. Your battle will be one of Abaji. My ancestors, I have seen the sign. I have seen the happy Joko bear fly past. It means freedom. Freedom after the destruction of the witch and saving the kingdom. My ancestors, I thank you for always helping me to take the right decision. My great forefathers, my fathers, grandfathers, take this. Gods of our land, take
Aida, what happened? Aida, what happened? What I saw with my eyes, my mouth cannot see it. Yes. What happened? What happened? You better go and see for yourself. You go, go and see for yourself. Go, go, go. Have you finished ranting, small rat? Take this thing away from her. She's not as sweet as I thought she could be. What would you do? I'll be greater than what you have done already. Huh? Maybe God punish you for what you have done. What do you mean you don't be greater than what you have done already? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, 
must go to his in one and fed him right away. We cannot sit at home and watch the God deliver in his status. We must know what the gods are saying over this strange occurrence. Kibwe, you are very right. We have to do something now because we are all in trouble. Oh, see, look at that. He's oh, coming. Wonderful. Let, let, us, let us go. go. Let us go. He will follow us. Why are you? I trust to say my father made this covenant. Salute the dead. If the heavens do not hear, the earth will hear. What end, Ifedema? Your end and also me. That's the one, Ifedema. We came to inform you of the... Of the evil child that was delivered today after two years with teeth. Yes, Ifedema. And they were burned alive in our very presence. And, but instead of roasting, the fire cleansed Otis's madness and his spell as well as that of uh, uh, Ozioma, and made the whole of them brand new people, including the baby. The Achi that is accompanying them is angry with us, especially me. A new god that was brought to and I supported them compounded the problem. One Vene is even helpless. Ah, you fed them. But no God is greater than one vene across the lands of the seven mountains and seven rivers. Where did they get the God? Is it from Ijebu or Aburima? My father, Obodo Wunde, Abai Mojoko, and Igebe Wokolo brought in a wicked god from Igala that perpetrated a lot of evil. And in anger for forcefully making me to serve Mbene, I took sides with them and I aided them. Well, except my father. Ajo Dibia and I do commune. Yes. I aid him to lie. And do lots of evil. I was angry! For forcefully making me to serve him, And I promise that Abaji will never know peace. Now, the God sent the son of the sun to bring light to Abaji and clear every evil doers including Chai what do we do now if we demand we have to go to the grave of Ethiopia and resurrect him same with Ijeli, Abangeli, and Okiapari, and merge them into one demon. And only then can we have enough force to fight that son of the sun. Else, none of us is safe because of what we did to the mother who is your man and Oti. What will it take? To resurrect them if you want to them. Come back to me. And I shall tell you.
Fear not! I am the one that sent the child to liberate this community from the siege of evil. Just follow my instructions and he shall live to fulfill the purpose for which I sent him. Go your right and you shall see a house with a naked lantern in front. That shall be your home. I shall be with you and guide you. There is a big war ahead, but do not despair, for I shall be with you always. Song of the song, song of the song, song of the song, song of the song.